doing a program such as Africa Scientific for Young Researchers is that it preaches the message that we need to hear mm -hmm. Africa for Africans, mm -hmm. African research for Africans, by Africans. So that is the message being uh, you know, educated about mm -hmm. in the Africa Scientific program. The most important thing is the skills development mm -hmm. because this is not a top-down um, program mm -hmm. but it's actually an engagement. Mm -hmm. The facilitators and the participants are having a conversation mm -hmm. and understanding what are the issues facing Africa. How can we, mm -hmm. as an Africa that is united, how can we solve those issues? How can we come up with better innovations that will better um, the issues that we as Africans are all experiencing? So there's a message of an Afrocentric science, mm -hmm. an Afrocentric um, agenda in terms of what kind of innovations we can come about, but as a unit. As in, so there's no individualism when it comes to this program. Mm -hmm. So the skills development, there's human capital development, that is what this program is about. Mm -hmm. And you can understand that this is something very rare. Mm -hmm. This is a program that has never been, mm -hmm. especially in South Africa, this is not even something that is available. So to mm -hmm. have something like this at a very low level of postgraduate studies, it will really help the participants in moving forward in selecting their careers and actually establishing what exactly are they good at. But that communication is important in saying that as though, even though you are a scientist taught in English, are you able to make your own language mm -hmm. the language of the future, the language of science for the future? Mm -hmm. And that is why this program is very good.